Good evening. <laughs> I wanted to say a really quick thank you today. Um, I know this may not make sense to others, but um, today I was called uh, self-righteous, which I've been called self-righteous before. I was called self-righteous and um, what else they use? What other term did they use? haughty that was it sorry so I was, I'm self-righteous and I'm haughty and that's on top of you know being called arrogant and pompous and all kinds of other things so and the reason why I am um, making this video is to encourage I want to encourage my brothers and sisters who are speaking truth that um, you know, when Jesus said, you know, uh, when he was speaking truth, speaking truth, he said that the world hated him and the world will hate you as it hated him. So, yes, um, I'm not well liked. And, you know, I don't have any, um, I don't have any ill feelings or any, um, anything in return other than um, sadness because, Here's the thing, um, I don't believe any um, ill feelings or um, negativity is worth going to hell over or worth going to tribulation over. It's like, uh, if you can't say anything nice, just don't say anything because everything you say and you do, you're going to be accountable for. So... The reason why I wanted to send a quick thank you is because, and this is sincere, is because it puts me in check. Meaning that when someone says that to me, I think about the things that I've said and my actions um, of that day. It makes me evaluate that day and question, yes, question, you know, am I being haughty? Am I, there's no such thing as self-righteousness, but am I being arrogant? Am I being, you know, I know it all, or am I just speaking truth? So it really, it helps me. It actually helps me in my walk because it keeps me humble. If that makes sense to anybody else, it keeps me humble. It makes me careful about what I say, what I do, how I say it, and it keeps me, you know, again, making sure each day that my walk is right and in not in right standings with how I think my right standings are I, I want to be right as far as how does the Lord Jesus Christ see me at this moment and I apologize for my shortcomings I'm not perfect uh, but I know in my heart that all I'm doing is speaking truth if someone wants to um, be offended by that and make accusations that aren't true that's on them I wish them nothing but, I said wish, sorry, I pray that they have peace in their mind and peace in their heart and that they're able to see clearly their own actions. And I pray for them. I pray for them as much as I pray for my own children. So thank you. Again, I want to just send a quick thank you before my family gets here that it keeps me humble and it does make me very careful about what I say. So I hope this encourages my brothers and sisters because we should be humble. And if somebody thinks that, you know, we're being something that we're not, at least it makes you look over your day and say, was I, was I arrogant? Was I, was pride in there? Because if so, well then go back to basics and ground yourself and say, okay, I'm going to humble myself and think about how I should represent myself the following day. So again, I hope this is encouraging you that um, they're going to say what they're going to say, but I wanted to thank you for those who, you know, are, I don't know, 
thinking that they're calling me out because at the end of the day, the only opinion, the only one, the only one person that can judge me is the Lord Jesus Christ at the end of each day. So what he thinks matters, your opinion, I was going to say, unfortunately, <laughs> I'm trying to get rid of that word too, regrettably, um, yeah, I would make sure that you are right with the Lord Jesus Christ too. It has nothing to do with me, but your actions you have to make sure you're right at the end of the day as well. So I love you and I hope you guys have a great Sunday and God bless.